हेलो एवरी वन दिस इज डॉक्टर स्वप्ना नायक गायनेकोलॉजिस्ट एंड सीनियर फर्टिलिटी कंसल्टेंट श्री स्वप्ना फर्टिलिटी सेंटर पंडापुर हैदराबाद क्लास यू थ्री इज क्लासिफाइड एज बाई कॉर्पोरियल यूट्रस दैट इज विद टू कॉर्पोर दैट इज टू बॉडी दिस क्लासिफिकेशन इज फर्दर क्लासिफाइड एज पार्शियल बाई कॉर्पोरियल कंप्लीट बाई कॉर्पोरियल बाई कॉर्पोरियल सेपरेट यूट्राई आर प्लेस इन दिस क्लास वेन द यूट्राइन काउंटर दैट इज आउटर काउंटर शोज इग्नेटेशन मोर देन फिफ्टी परसेंट ऑफ द माइमेट्रियल वॉल थिकनेस अलॉन्ग विद द डिविजन ऑफ द एंडोमेट्रियल कैविटी ऑल्सो वेन दिस इग्नेटेशन डिवाइड्स कॉर्पस ऑफ द यूट्रस टिल इंटरनल ऑस्ट इट इज कंप्लीट बाई कॉर्पोरियल एंड इफ इट इज शॉर्ट ऑफ दैट इट इज पार्शियल बाई कॉर्पोरियल बट इफ इन स्पाइट ऑफ इग्नेटेशन ऑफ द फंडस द डिवाइडिंग वॉल बिटवीन द टू एंडोमेट्रियल कैविटीज Its thickness is 1.5 times the myometrial wall thickness. This is named as bicorporeal septate uterus. Anomalies cla- classified or included in this class were earlier named as bicornuate uterus and uterus didelphis. If complete bicorporeal uterus also has a double cervix, it is uterus didelphis according to AFS classification. For bicorporeal uterus, pregnancy prognosis is the best. 64% among all the congenital uterine abnormalities unification of the uterus is rarely required partially in this era of good uh, obstetric care and the good neonatal care late trimester babies can be well managed in neonatal intensive care units these patients have cervical incompetence in up to 40% of patients cervical encephalage is the primary line of treatment and the results are parallel to metroplasty that is trasmus operation abortion rate quoted in these type of cases that is a bicorporeal uterus is 20 to 40% arcuate uterus is called arcuate when the indentation in the endometrial cavity is less than 50% of the myometrial wall thickness with normal fundal corpus this is more considered an abnormal shape evidently it does not require any treatment class u4 is a hemi uterus also called as unicornuate uterus Unicornuate uterus is again divided as with rudimentary horn and without rudimentary horn. It is seen in 6 to 20 percent of all the congenital uterine abnormalities. About 90 percent of patients having hemi uterus have a rudimentary horn, but it may be communicating or non-communicating with a well-formed cornu. Rudimentary horn should be removed in case of hematometra, ectopic pregnancy, or severe dysmenorrhea. In 40 percent of cases. they are associated with renal anomalies now it has a worst outcome amongst all the congenital uterine malformations fetal loss can be up to 40 to 45% before completion of the second trimester preterm deliveries are extremely common abortions are due to abdominal vasculature decreased muscle mass and reduced space prophylactic cervical cerclage is extremely useful Vaginal micronized progesterone is very useful to prevent uterine contraction. Thank you.